the word of God today in Matthew 11 chapter uh, in Matthew chapter 11 verse 28 says come to me all who are weary and heavily burdened and I will give you rest brothers and sisters this is the day that the Lord has made and we have to rejoice and be glad in it this is the day of the Lord and let us prepare our heart let us prepare our spirit to meet our God to meet our Creator today hallelujah hallelujah whatever burden we have ano man po yung mga gumugulo sa atin pong puso at isipan ngayong araw let us cast it all unto our God let us cast all our burdens our worries our fears to our God because God is calling us today Jesus is calling us that uh, we need to come to Him. All who are weary sa mga pagod na, pagod na isip, pagod na katawan. Let us rest in the presence of our God today. Amen. Hallelujah. San man po tayo naroroon ngayon, let us Close our eyes and let us feel the presence of our God. Let us allow Him to touch us, to touch our tired bodies, our sick soul, and our spirit.
welcome, fill this place, fill our hearts today. Oh, let us welcome Him, welcome you, God. We welcome you, Jesus. We welcome you, Holy Spirit. can we close our eyes and let us focus our eyes unto him now let us prepare our hearts our soul to enter into the holy of holies and be with our God be with our Savior today Whatever situation we are in now, ano man po ang mga nasa puso natin, ang mga nararanasan po natin, let us set aside and let us meet our God today. Yes, let us prepare our hearts. Let us commune with our God today, for He is very much excited to meet us today. Let, he is very much excited to meet us today. And so let us prepare our hearts, let us prepare our soul in meeting our God today. Oh, Let us enter, let us enter into the holy of holies. Enter, enter in, enter into his presence. Enter in, enter into his presence. Oh, let us enter, enter into his presence. Oh, shall
unto me all who are weary all who carry burdens and God said I will give you rest oh come and rest come and rest in his presence come and rest you tired body come and rest in his presence you tired soul come and rest into the presence of God So as we continue to uh, commune with our God today, as we continue to be excited and be satisfied by His presence, today we will sing, we will dance and shout of the joy that we are experiencing right now. And I believe every day of the past days na ating experience, I believe that you have that satisfaction, that you have that overflowing joy in your heart. And today it is the day that the Lord has made for us to rejoice together and thank Him for what He have done. Hallelujah. Can we clap our hands for the Lord? And let's sing for praises for our God. Hallelujah. As we sing this song, let us have the faith that sooner or later we will be a tree of life that planted by our God. Hallelujah. Seed is one tiny little seed It is seed in the hand of God And on that seed I saw a grace Which were beaten down by God Abundant grace fills every day Every moment God is watching us In love and joy planting the seed Day by day growing into a tree of life Once again, a seed a seed is one tiny little seed It is in the hand of God And on that seed I found our names Which were written down by God Abundant grace fills every day Every moment God is watching us In love and joy planting the seed Day by day growing into a tree of life Come on, see. Of life planted to transform the earth. Joy, joy, joy. With fruit of the spirit, we will see miracles. Live out Christ's mercy to heal broken hearted ones. A song of praise. Joy, 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 joy. And on that seed I found our names Which were written down by God Abundant grace fills every day Every moment 
man, God is watching us in love and joy, planting the seed day by day, growing into a tree of life. Joy, 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 tree of life planted to trust for the earth. Joy, 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 we do of the spirit will see miracles. We Souls without freedom and truth for His glory and presence. Let everyone become one. Revive our God. Sing, joy, 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 joy. Speed of life, plants and good trucks for the earth. Joy, joy, joy. We put up that spirit and we will see miracles. So more praise, joy, joy, joy. The spirit of God reigns down and fills all the land. Joy, joy, joy. The moon of God shines on the wind and slumber souls. Lord, thank you for planting us to become a tree of life in all the places that you have put us, O oh Lord. Thank you, Jesus. And let's continue to worship our God. Let us continue to sing praises for Him, for He deserves Hallelujah. Let's clap our hands for our God. Yes, Jesus. Hallelujah.
affected by it, O oh God. For we know, Lord, that you satisfy not only our heart, but even our soul, our body, O oh Lord. And to you, we just entrust everything, O oh God. Whatever situation that we have, O oh God. One thing is, we, is always we know, O oh God, in our lives. That you is enough, O oh Lord. No more, Panginoon, sa mga taong maaaring inaasahan namin, O oh Lord. No more, O oh Lord, in any alternatives, O oh God. But you alone, Christ, is enough. You alone, O oh God, is the answer. You alone, O oh God, is the source of power, the source of joy, satisfaction, everything, O oh God. Actually, Lord, wala naman po, Panginoon, na mayroong may pagmamayabang ang bawat isa, O oh God. But it comes from you alone, O oh God. And today, we just want to declare, O oh God, that you are enough in our lives, O oh God. Come always lead us, O oh Lord. Come always let your presence be filled, Panginoon, by everyone of God. Fill this place, O oh God, with your presence. Hallelujah, Jesus. Christ is my Enough. 
You are the great I am. Panginoon, maraming salamat. For you have given us this life so we can glorify your name. Maraming alok ang mundo sa amin. Subalit ang lahat ng ito, Panginoon. Hindi ito ang buhay. Hindi ito, Panginoon, ang tunay na kalagaya. But you, O oh God, You are our everything. You are the great I am. Hallelujah. Brothers and sisters, God is our everything. Siya yung nagsabi, I am. Bago po tayo dumako sa banal hapunan sa araw po na ito. Si Moses ay nagtanong. Ang sabi niya sa Panginoon, kung tatanungin kong sinong nagsugo sa akin, ano ang sasabihin ko? And God answered him and said, I am who I am. Sa buhay po ng tao, marami po tayong pangangailangan. But know that God is the I am of our life. When we are in need, He is the I am who will provide for us. When we are sick, He is the I am that heals When we are weak at tayo po ay nahulog sa kasalanan, He is Thy am our righteousness. When we are alone and we are so afraid, He is Thy am the God who is with us. When we are in great trouble, He is the I am, our shalom, our peace. Today, God is our everything. Maging sa inyong lahat na nasa tahanan ninyo kung kayo na inanonood kayo. As we stand before the presence of the Lord, ano man ang kalagayan natin sa buhay sa mga panahon po na ito, ano mang pangailangan, Today, I want you to stand before God. God is more than enough para po katagpuin ang lahat ng ating mga pangangailangan. Now, I want you to lift your hands as high as you can. He is the great I am. In His name, all things are possible. If you're sick, He will heal you. He can give you the inner peace that the world cannot offer. The great satisfaction for He will surely provide for all your needs because He is God. Panginoon, sa umaga pong ito, we're standing before your very presence. Alam mo, Panginoon, ang bawat pangangailangan ng iyong mga anak. Kami na nandito ngayon sa church o maging sa mga taong nanonood sa kanila pong mga tahanan. Hindi maiksi ang iyong kamay upang iabot ang lahat ng pangangailangan ng iyong mga anak. Hindi ka bingi na hindi mo kami maririnig sapagat sinabi mo sa iyong salita, Panginoon, when we call upon your name, you will answer us and you will show forth great and mighty things 
na hindi pa man namin naranas at nakita at narinig sa buhay po namin. And so today, Lord, in Jesus' name, we're coming before you. Lord, touch this life. Touch everyone's life. Sapagat ang bawat hinahawakan mo, Panginoon, nagkakaroon ng himala. Ang bawat nadadantayan ng iyong mga kamay, Panginoon, nagkakaroon po ng buhay. Lord, today we're coming before you. Touch us. Lord, bring us life. Maging Panginoon sa lahat ng may sakit sa araw po nito, may you touch them. Lord, I pray for the miracle touch mo, Panginoon. Hawakan mo ang kanilang mga buhay. Abutin mo sila, Panginoon, sa kanilang mga tahanan. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. At Panginoon, lahat ng mga nagdadalamhati, ang lahat, Panginoon, ng namatayan, Lord, I pray, may you comfort them, O God, with your touch. You will never leave us orphans, for you are our God and you are our Father. Lord, sa lahat ng may mga pangailangan sa araw ko na ito, huwag matapos, Panginoon, ang gawain na ito, Panginoon, na hindi po nila tinanggap ang kanila pong mga miracles. For you are the great I am. Panginoon, in your name, all things are possible. Shall we just give God thanks for the miracle that in Angapona natin? By faith, claim it. If you receive it, deliver it. Thank God for that. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus, for the miracle. Thank you, Lord God. Hallelujah for the great, for the great, great supply na hindi na pong pinagkalo. Thank you for the healing. Thank you, Lord God, for the healing, Panginoon, ng aming mga katawan. Thank you, Lord, for the healing of our soul, body, and spirit. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. And today, Lord, I pray. Sa araw po nito, Panginoon, walang lalabas sa lugar nito. Empty-handed. But Lord, ano man ang desire ng puso ng bawat isa, Tanggapin namin ito, Panginoon, ng may kagalakan. Sabagat sinabi po, Panginoon, sa iyong mga salita, If we ask anything, in the name of Jesus, you will give it for the glory of the Father, so that our joy be complete. And we receive our miracle today. We receive it right now in Jesus' name. We receive it, O Lord God, in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Shall we say hallelujah? Shall we say and shout hallelujah? Oh, hallelujah. Come on, lift your voice and worship the Lord. Hallelujah.
Pwede po bang i-distribute ang lahat ng mga tinapay? Hallelujah. Christ is more than enough for us. Two thousand years ago, nung ang tao ay wala na pong pag-asa. Nung ang tao, we are all doomed dahil po sa kasalanan na tinanggap natin sa atin pong mga ninuno. God offered His Son, Jesus, as a solution upang ang tao po ay maligtas. Hinubad ng Panginoon ang kanya pong pagkadyos. Iniwan ang kanyang trono sa langit. Siya po ay nagkatawang tao. Bumaba sa lupa. Ang siya po ay naging parang alipin. Naging masunurin hanggang sa kamatayan sa krus ng Kalbaryo. Para po sa katubusan ng lahat. Ang kanyang dugo ay nabuhos upang ang tao na wala ng solusyon, kapatawaran, sa kasalanan ng ginawa, ay nagkaroon po tayo ng kapatawaran. Ang tao na puno ng sumpa dahil sa kasalanan, Tayo po ay nagkaroon ng kagalingan sa Panginoon. Tinanggap ng kanyang katawang ang lahat ng lamay, ang lahat ng sugat na dapat sanay para sa atin. And the Bible says, By His wounds we are healed. Dahil sa mga sugat na tinanggap niya, tayong lahat ay napagaling. Ano mang sakit at karamdaman na meron sa balat ng lupa, dalawang libong taon ang nakararaan. Ipinagkalob na ng Panginoong Yesus ang kagalingan para sa lahat ng tao. That if we believe to what Jesus had done in the cross, His finished work in the, work, in the cross of Calvary, if we believe, we will receive it even today. Ang salvation, the free gift of God, it become free, it's because Jesus paid the price for our salvation. Lord, maraming salamat. Tinanggap mo ang parusa na dapat ay para sa amin. Nabuhos ang iyong dugo, Panginoon upang lahat kami mapatawad sa lahat ng aming mga kasalanan. Sino kami, Panginoon, para iligtas mo? But because you love your people, you have saved us. Ang katawan mo, Panginoon, tumanggap ng maraming mga sugat para kami mapagaling. We are not worthy, O God, for the sacrifice. Because of your love, you have saved us. Now, we are healed. You became very poor in the cross. So that, Lord, kami na mga anak mo, pinayaman mo ng dahil sa kahirapan na tinanggap mo sa krus ng Kalbaryo. Kulang ang aming mga bibig para pasalamatan ka. Sapat, Panginoon, ang ginawa mo sa Cruz ng Kalbaryo para paniwalaan. Diyos ka, ikaw ang Panginoon na dapat naming sapahin. Today, my brothers and sisters, 
tayo po ay makikibahagi sa Lord's Supper po na ito. Ang mga tinapay na hawak po natin ay simusumbulo sa katawan ni Kristo. Tumanggap ng maraming mga sugan. Dahilan kung bakit tayo ay napagali. The juice that symbolizes the blood of Jesus, siya lamang ang may kapangyarihan na nagpatawad sa lahat ng ating mga sala. Not our own selves, not our religion, but it's the Lord Jesus. For I received from the Lord that which I also delivered to you, that the Lord Jesus, on the same night in which he was betrayed, took bread. And when in given thanks, he broke it and said, Take it, this is my body, which is broken for you. Do this in remembrance of me. Sabay-sabay nga po natin kanin ng mga tinapay. In the same manner, he also took the cup after supper and saying, This cup is the new covenant in my blood. This do as often as you drink it in remembrance of me. Sabay-sabay po natin inumin. Lord, we believe. It is your finished work in the cross that we are saved. It is your finished work in the cross, Lord, that we are healed. Now we receive it, O Lord, in the name of Jesus. And everyone will say,